Hello guys and welcome back to Cat Arts and today I have my laptop with me not for digital art but for a craft video. So the top of my laptop is a bit textured if you can see it. There are horizontal lines and so I thought I have to choose something that would look good on texture. So I decided to go with the masterpiece by Van Gogh that is Starry Night. Yes, if you have been subscribed to my channel from like my journal days, you would know that my journal has a cover which is the Starry Night and you might know from that how much I love this painting. So as I started uh, to draw, I noticed that the painting had an underpainting of this yellowish, brownish, ochre like color. So I didn't know why go put it there but I thought there must be a good reason like he's a master so I copied it and oh my god this was really helpful because since the painting is mostly dark blue based this background gave it such a beautiful pop of color because it's kind of the complementary color of the color that is being used in the painting the most so this was a, like following go was a really good idea so yeah and then um, with this stippling I won't call it stippling but it's more like tiny little strokes I'm putting these tiny little strokes to copy Go's style of course it's not never going to be the way he did it but um, I am not trying to exactly copy him but kind of uh, bring the uh, starry night aesthetic on my laptop so um, you must be thinking that why I am doing this like why i'm straight up painting on my laptop i could have just gotten myself a, a good looking skin or something i seriously don't know why uh, like i have had this laptop for years and i haven't um ever thought of like covering it with a skin maybe because i never found a skin that really uh, struck me as something that i would want to define me you know by putting it on my laptop um, and then I started my channel and I thought this would be good content like why not just straight up start painting on it and it's acrylic paint it's not like um, it's not gonna ever come off and if I want I can put a skin on top of it so I decided to just go with it and I think this was a good decision because number one I got to replicate one of my favorite um, artists and secondly my laptop ended up looking pretty dope but um, there's one thing that I messed up a little um, I'm not too disappointed about it but if you notice right now as you can see my laptop is from HP well the sign is upside down you know what that means that the whole painting that I'm making is actually upside down I realized it um, a little too late of course by the time I ended and opened my laptop I realized that when I open it it's upside down and it was heartbreaking but then again I mean I, what can I say I like I'm trying to console myself so okay if you guys want to customize your uh, laptop then just don't make the mistake that I made make sure that um, you are uh, placing the laptop in such a way that uh, the, uh, the the side from where it opens is away from you and not towards you like don't start painting on it just by closing your laptop turn it around and then start working on it or you could just uh, follow the easiest method that if your laptop has a logo on top of it just see if the logo is upside down or not like I was so stupid to not even notice that much but it's okay I'm not gonna you know uh, scream at myself for it um, there are gonna be more chances of for me to repaint it anytime I want and uh, so I think I should stop overthinking about it so about why I chose my laptop well ever since this stupid pandemic started um, everything has been confined to my laptop uh, like not like not like my life didn't depend on it before the pandemic but now it's like being used used even more um, 
like I have my glasses and my my um, paintings and my hobbies and shows that I watch everything I just do it through my laptop so um, I have to look at it every day and I kind of bo- got bored of looking at the silver shade of it so I thought why not just add some spice to it so this is why I decided to go with this one for my crop video and it's been a while since I last uploaded a um, crop so it was a win-win situation except that I <laughs> painted it upside down but uh, I'm going to forgive myself for that um and about why I chose this painting well because it is one of my favorite paintings um if you guys uh, have been following my channel for a while you would know that i really love to draw skies um like clouds and skies and stars and stuff um most of my craft videos you have that you have watched are uh, kind of themed around these things um and around this this dark blue midnight blue color so <clears throat> this painting has always been uh kind of like my aesthetic so i decided to choose this one and that was a good decision so now the fun part begins we gonna tear off these masking tapes and uh i think the edges look really good i mean you can say that they are not exactly perfect but that's what th- this painting is about it's textured and this textured uh sides look good and hear the sound when i peel off the uh, tape uh, vertically i'm sorry you had to hear that wind also Um anyway now we're done and it's upside down but I don't care cuz it looks beautiful and I mean it's amazing it's one of the best things that I have drawn probably and I'm going to cherish this one so I hope you guys also like it as much as I do and if you want to try this out with your laptop then don't forget to upload those pictures on Instagram and tag me I'm art by catastrophe on Instagram Um I I'll see you guys in the next video which will come out next Sunday till then don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already press the bell icon to be notified every time I upload a new video stay safe and take care bye guys